Let me get in. Let me let me let me pull up the card right quick. Um, let me see. So first battle you got T Top versus Clips. In my opinion, I think Clips gonna take it. Um two one. Um the reason why I feel that way is cause Clips is that nigga right now. I mean, I'm not gonna say he like the greatest of all time, but right now, Clips is that nigga. As a vet. And the nigga who been doing this shit for years. Um Clips is that nigga right now. Um I think for T Top this is probably gonna be his hardest battle yet. I mean I I've been seeing a couple T Top battles. Um and the nigga dope. I fuck with him. Um, but I mean, I don't think this is some he gonna be take. He gonna have to take lightly. I mean, as far as on T top side, I mean, I seen the videos, the, the videos leading up to the to the event, which it goes down tomorrow. Um, I don't know. I'm not gonna be, I'm gonna be able to watch the shit, but I'm gonna try to catch it. The highlights and shit. Uh, when, when Smack drop it, shout out to Smack too. Um, but yeah, I, I don't think as far as T Top go, I don't think he bullshitting, and I think he, cause he got something to prove. Um, as everybody else has been saying, but I, I do think he got something to prove as far as him being the best out of the the rookies um, that was picked for this card. Um, I do think. As far as clips, um, clips is is going the right way about this battle because usually he don't take you know he don't take battles serious. The battles that he have before a big battle, he don't take serious. So for him to take this battle serious is is you know him making a, a good decision. Um. But yeah, I got Clips taking that one two one because I mean with Clips, you know, come on, Nick got jokes, he got schemes, um, bars for days, he can bar a nigga life away, um, and he can freestyle when he need to and when he want to. I mean, hell, he freestyled the whole battle. So I, I, I got Clips taking that one. Um, but I do think T Top is gonna put up a fight. I don't think it's gonna be like a, a body. I mean, you know, I don't think T Top is gonna T Top is gonna give him a run for his money. So that's what I got for that battle. Um, Briz Rothstein versus Aver. Um, I think uh, I ain't seen too many of Briz battles. So this one is kind of. You know, I don't really know how to call this one. Um, the last battle I seen with Ver, it was, well, I seen the one him and Clips, and he got body. Like, Clips, like, ate that nigga alive. Right? And then I seen the battle with him and Hitman, um, and he kind of, that was, that was better. Um, I think he had an edged hitman in that one. Um, but I don't know how to call this one. So I only seen Briz battle like one time. And I've seen like two or three Bird battles. So I mean, I think Bird, I think Bird might get it. I think Bird might take it 2 1. I don't know yet. But uh, yeah, I don't know how to call that one either. But I think, I think I'm leaning more towards Bird for that one. So. You get then next you got Mr. Wavy versus K Shine. Now I seen the in the in studios for for this one and the one for, for clips and, and top. And Mr. Wavy was talking mad shit, talking about he on 3 0 K Shine and K Shine was blowing that shit off because you know, you know how new niggas is, they 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 come with that drive or whatever. And you know when Sean was talking about, he reminded him of himself when he was younger. It was funny as hell. But as far as this battle go, it's hard to call. I mean, I do think Kane Sean is 
hungrier than ever. Um, I'm watching him battle too. Um, seeing him body niggas too. Um, but I think, I don't know, I think K Shine might show him up because Wavy was talking mad shit like he on 3 0 Shine. Like, I'm like, word? Like, that's how you feel? I mean, niggas, got, niggas can have opinions, but, you know, I don't, I don't know. I think K Shine is gonna give him a run for his money. I think at the best, I mean, if, if K Shine don't don't come with that aggression like he usually do, you know, he might get, you know, I ain't gonna say he ain't gonna get body, but, you know what I'm saying, like, he might get around, but I don't know. I think Wavy is really cocky right now, on some cocky shit right now. You know what I'm saying? Nine times out of ten, when niggas be on cocky shit, they lose. So, I don't know. I mean, I've never seen him battle. Um, I've seen a couple K-Shine battles. I've, you know, like I said, I mean, it depends on how K-Shine shows up. If he shows up on the usual, or he goes back to the old K-Shine, then, shit, nine times out of ten, K-Shine might get the 3 up. You know? So, I don't know. That's how I feel about that one. Um, let's see what's the next battle. Um, we got we got chess and DNA. Um, for this one, I think I think DNA gonna take it because to me, I think DNA is gonna three zero chess. Well, he might give him a round, but I don't know. I think I seen chess battle one time. And to me, Chess don't really got that much enthusiasm when he battle. And I've seen DNA battle. DNA comes with facts. DNA can punch. You know, not, not too many niggas think DNA can punch. Niggas can forget that. Like, DNA actually does his homework on niggas that he go against. So, I mean, I think Chess gonna have to do his homework too. You know, so... Um, I thought I got DNA in that one, either three zero or two one. You know, with that one. Um, next up we got the Saga versus Shotgun Show. I can't call this one. I've never seen Shotgun Show battle. Never seen the Saga battle. But a lot of people are leaning more towards the Saga than Show, because a lot of people think Show gonna choke. Apparently, in some of his battles, he choke. And, and, and most of his battles, Shug like to pocket check niggas, which I find can either go either way, depending on who you battle. Like, because niggas don't like motherfuckers touching them and shit, like when they're battling. So, um, my thing is, I don't know. Because the saga came out and said, Shug can't really tell him shit that he ain't heard before. So I think that can go either way, um, but I don't know. I can't call that one because um, I've never seen either one of them battle before. So that one's kind of up in the air. So that's my thoughts on that one. Then you got Prep versus John John. Yo, I think John John might edge Prep. Man. It's a good. I've never seen Prep battle. I've seen John John like. I've seen John John put in some work. Um, I think John John, John John can either go two one or three up. Cause John John been hungry lately. John John can freestyle. John John got bars, and you know that shit can go either way. So I don't even know what that one. I mean, for me, for that one, I'm leaning more towards John John. I mean, I'm not sleeping on prep. I just think John John is really hungry. Like, and he really wants, you know what I'm saying? John John wants to solidify himself as a vet. You know what I'm saying? So, um, I feel like I'm leaning more towards John John with that. So, yeah. Um, and then last one, we got Snow versus Real Deal. Now, I've never heard of Real Deal. I know that some of y'all might be like, really, nigga, you're not really a real battle rap fan, but I've never heard 
the real deal. Like, I've heard about snow. I've seen snow battle T-Top. Um, nah, I can't call this one either because... And then I know it's, it's ironic and it's kind of fucked up that I know, I know the, the rookie, <clears throat> but not the vet, which is crazy. But <clears throat> that's how it is. Um, I can't call this one either. Um, I've seen Snow Battle one time. I've never heard a real deal. So that one can go either way too. So um, as far as the whole card, I'm up for rookies, but you know how rookies are cocky. Some of them cocky, some of them confident. They think they can win. But I'm leaning more towards the vets. You know what I'm saying? If you. If you. If, if you. I can respect. Always respect people who put in work. You know what I'm saying? So. It's kind of like. You know, a bunch of Michael Jordans. If Mike, if Mike was still in the league now, and then you have somebody like a young LeBron come up, talking shit, you know, thinking he can beat the, the greatest, you know, and shit like that. But I always, I'm, I'm leaning more towards the bets for this. Uh, I just think, uh, I don't think no none of the bets is gonna lose. I mean, but we'll have to see find out so those are my predictions um yeah if you feel different comment leave a comment at the bottom or you know whatever so yeah if you feel different or you want to respond or put your predictions in the comments so it's whatever but those are my predictions yep Hope y'all enjoy it.